Probably no. Well, to be fair, Law TV Nurgle, not that terrifying. Um, four journeymen to actually have the higher TV. Tina Turner there. One, two, lost one with Nurgle's pretty good. Strength Rod is pretty good. Extra Arms, Pestigore is terrible. But there you go. Some people still, still living by the, uh, still living by the Lupac playbook there. Going for the uh, extra arms. <sighs> what a disaster. What a disaster that game was. Wouldn't have conceded, but he kept fouling, didn't he? So there was just no point. No point endangering the team by not conceding. Sad times, eh? Sorry, I'm just doing stuff on cross out here. Uh, I build that. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's a good idea, one grenade. That's a very good idea. <laughs> oh god, and he's choosing a kick. Interesting. He's got a reserve. Oh man. These loner skinks. I guess the team's the team's taken shape now because the loner skinks never die. So having more having more loner skinks is just better, isn't it? That's the play. Have as many loner skinks as possible, and then never take any cars. I've cracked it. I've cracked out a how to develop lizards. That is the question, Kiss Mackey. It depends. If you if you think you're going to qualify for the playoffs or well. Okay, it depends. Are you um There's no playoffs this season. If you're in a league where there's eventually playoffs or it's multiple seasons and eventually your team will get to two thousand T V, then take agility. If you're playing in ladder where or a league, or like a shorter league, then take dodge or block. Um, there you go. That's all I got to say about that. <laughs> Take the words over it. Well, yeah, in that case, in that case, then I would recommend take block or dodge because they're better. Um, 
The thing is, block and dodge. Dodge and agility is pretty good. But, um... But just dodge or block by itself is better than just agility by itself. So, eventually, the agility will be worth it. But it'll just take a while. I think that's the thing. So... It's not even about the TV, it's just about the development of the team and what's better now, really. Like, even if they were the same TV. If agility was the same TV, I still would rather have block and dodge first. Well, dodge before edge. If you already had dodge, the edge would be fine. But edge without dodge is just fucking horrible. Glorious! Glorious. Holy Balsack, I got charged again with 554 euros after taxes. Just because I cannot fathom how to cancel a subscription. <laughs> I hate to come up with new explanations for my failure every month. <laughs> you deserve it. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Thank you very much, Yuri Styles. Thank you for staying fantastic. Six months. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> Try to kill a fly that failed. Thank you very, very much. There's also Jim Power emotes now as well, by the way. In case, in case you're not interested in Cross Art, they debuted last night. The new emotes. There's Jim Mad, and there's uh, finally Jim Mad, and finally Jim Power. So there you go. Every time, useless. Cunt of a fucking Croxagore, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Thank you very, very much. Wow. These fucking games, man. I knew the Crocs would fail me if I relied on him, but... I had to go for it, didn't I, with him putting the, putting the thing on the line. I didn't have to, but wanted to. Maybe tilted after the uh, previous matches, eh? You could argue. I think tilting Blood Bowl comes not from, like, not, like, angry all-in and calls like it does on in poker, but, like, just being too much of a little bitch, like after you, you know, like not, not going for something that you should do, like you know, like maybe you should make a GFI to not get blitzed, but you think, oh no, I'll roll a one if I GFI. Um, I think there, that's the more, the more blood bowl tilt kind of thing. Obviously, there's the moronic uh, fouling, you know, angry fouling when you've lost and stuff. But, like, for good players tilting, I think that's that's the biggest kind of tilt. Really. Biggest, most common. Thing. Really stupid, really stupid. Did he just block his guys down? Should have got blocked. Oh, 
Oh, she got that, she knows it's just that one. No rerolls on any of them, so I might as well go for the crocs. Block two, for the pickup. Oh, I didn't see that. Didn't see that block. That was bad, wasn't it? That was bad. Should have made that block first. I'm not with it now. <laughs> to be fair, I'm not 100% focused on Blood Bowl. Maybe I should have uh, stopped. Just got a few. Got a few viewers having a. Um, I don't know. I want to play more Blood Bowl and less Cross Out. Even though, even though I enjoy playing Cross Out more than playing Blood Bowl. Because Blood Bowls where all the uh, where all the subs are from, isn't it? Basically. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. <laughs> burp, burp, burp. <laughs> Every game counts. Yeah. <laughs> Every game absolutely can. And you can be, and usually is shit. Wow, he's even hurting. He's even hurting the fucking um, journeyman skinks. What the fuck is happening? That just doesn't make any sense. Kazansaurus is one thing. But journeyman skinks, get out of town. Ah, oh, yeah, on the badly hurt, yeah, that's true. Yeah, he did it eventually well, though. So, nice couple of gym pals there to round it off. Fantastic. Hello, Astro Tall. How did you do?
<laughs> yeah. To be fair, it's a great game. It is a great game. I, d I do love it. It's just fucking frustrating sometimes, isn't it? I didn't make my pushes bright enough, did I? Not compared to the computer game. Anymore. Yeah, it is a great game. I do love it, but... This fly is pissing me off. Right. Fucking hell, this fly is just. <sighs> Can't really fucking deal with this fly. I gotta go for him, haven't I? Because I might just roll one against the uh, thing in there and he's got block. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go all in on the crocs ago, not failing it. That seems a good idea given his performance in previous games. Wanna in war wanna. No, oh, brilliant. Ah, oh, yes. That's the way to do it. I mean, it's a two plus, isn't it? To be fair, my guys have block. His he doesn't. Haha! <laughs> I've got block. You don't. This one, I guess that's not worth doing. He's only. Oh no, he's got two. He got an extra one. It depends, doesn't it? If you can only get two dice on a skink, then you've only got 30% chance to knock him over instead of 55. If you can three dice him, then, um, or you've got block, or tackle, then, um, come on, all of one there. Deserve the one for that. Reed re roll it? Probably. Yeah, I knew he would. <laughs> oh dear. What a laugh for you. Yep, he won dice is there. Wasting his ring on. Time done. 
90 floor. Not bad. Again, got to be a bit, a bit rowdy here, don't I? With uh, protecting the ball. Because I've only got two players that can guaranteed move. I guess what I could do is I could dodge here and then blitz with him. Dead Marauder, get fucked up. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six. He could go there. If it works. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, but I want to get I want to get him there for sure, don't I? So he wants to try to go to here. Now we'll try to go to there, and then if he'd failed, the skin could have gone in there. Could hit that. Could hit that fucking thing, couldn't I, actually? Now it's not that easy to get round to um, the system up, is it? He's played this pretty badly, I think. Considering. Uh, I guess not, I've made two removals. But considering I've hardly been playing. Hardly been playing. He's made a Kaz. Failed two pickups. Maybe he's regretting his silly greed block now. Greed reroll. That was an incredibly greedy reroll. To to do that with uh, with Nurgle is uh, incredibly greedy, isn't it? With no block at all and everything. So he stood him up, of course he did. Oh, of, course. of course. Had to happen, didn't it? That, after I move in an extra skink, that was the risk. Obviously moving in the extra skink. And then fucking failing. Oh, that was a dodge, didn't see it. That was bad. Should have made the block. First, but never mind. He's not going to score in three turns without a reroll, is he? So, two turns without a reroll. That was really bad because now I can't even make this block. <laughs> yeah, it's a leader crux, yeah. 
Yeah, exactly. He made, he made two GFIs to get the assists and then re-rolled the 2D on the cross. C fucking crazy. Crazy play. Deserves to lose because of that, really. Yeah, the Crocs isn't that bad. He only, you know, every time he's got to make a crucial move, he just boneheads. So he doesn't. He doesn't actually. He doesn't actually cause turnovers, <laughs> which does make him a pretty good Crocs. Yeah. At the end of the day. Face the ball. If only there was a, if only there was a one in twelve nine six way to deal with that. Him. Might be able to stall it for another turn here, but then there's no real need to, is there? Because he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna two turn. So. Two dice him. Yeah. Blockity block block block. You got a cheeky, cheeky titty foul. Gotta love the touchdown foul. Gotta love it. Is it even Blood Bowl 2 if you don't touchdown foul? Yeah, I enjoyed that on Reddit as well. Yeah, I saw that. It's true though. Like, it's tiring Sage's level of, of self promotion. I'll use it till it's fixed. <laughs> it's fun, isn't it? It is fun. Like, it's pro probably the most fun I get from playing Blood Bowl is touchdown power. So. Yeah, I'll be sad when they fix it, to be honest. It started off as let's draw attention to this ludicrous thing that should, shouldn't be in the game. And it's terrible that they haven't fixed it. Been in since launch and they still haven't fixed it. And then it just evolved into my favourite thing to do in a game of football. Um, so yeah, I'll be sad. I'll be sad when they actually fix it. Just loudly. I'll try to kick off at my own court. No. no I'm <laughs> oh 
God, I actually, I, do you know what? I actually would shatter that. I actually would have it as a house rule. That would be fucking good. I, I think it fits. It fits Blood Bowl having it as a as a house rule. To be fair, it's a kind of a Blood Bowl. It's a very Blood Bowl thing to do, isn't it? I should have kept up the same time, yeah, that's true. To be fair though, this level of self-promotion will probably probably cost him in the end, because it's like, you know it's his uh it's a small kind of community, isn't it? And while the likes of Mr. Boss FTW are really fucking annoying in uh, GTA, he's already fucking massive, so it doesn't matter if he pisses off half the people, does it? Because he still gets a million views. Well, more than a million views. Because if Sage pisses off half the people from advertising himself all the time, he'll end up with not very many views at all. So... He may shoot himself in the, in the foot. Yeah, of course, of course, Pathless T, yeah, of course. Say, same with Kanar, you know. They're, they are paragons of uh, virtue. <laughs> Would never do anything, anything bad ever. Perfect humans. Maybe it was just Kanor. Kanor Kano went on about it for a long time. That's what I'm hoping for, Arrested Development. That's what I'm hoping for. Yeah, he does, doesn't he, with the whole, the whole turn 16 fouls and stuff. That's pretty tough, because if I put a guy in there, or two guys in, which I can't really afford, to free him up, we might just be the one dice, eh? Double GFIs. No, I'd have to dodge as well. Just go for the one dice. Yeah, that's true. The kind of people who think no good will come to the team. Absolutely. Yes, Ed the Mad, yeah. Yeah, that's why it, that's why it's that's why I do it. Fucking hell, I wouldn't do it if I could get sent off. That's why it's ridiculous, because it's just like it's just the best thing to do. <laughs> it's not a bug, it's a feature. It's been in since release, but only known about for months. Um, thanks to Shawnee. Finally killed the fucking fly. It um landed on the microphone. So I muted myself just then and smashed the microphone and it was alright. Yeah, explain it with Fluff Players TD Celebration Dance. I like it. I honestly like. I honestly like touchdown fouling. I think it's a. I think it's a good mechanic. Like it's a blood ball like mechanic, isn't it? To when you, 
when you score, you fucking knock one of their players. It's a pretty blood body thing to do, to be fair. Fash just doesn't even stream it. He plays Albion all day and doesn't stream it. What the fuck? Yeah, he's just being a slave to Luca. What the fuck is that about? What the fuck? Who the fuck is that guy? I can't believe Fash has done it, man. He's, I would watch him fucking bashing rocks and fucking trees or whatever the fuck he does. But he just doesn't even stream anymore. Motherfucker. He's lucky he's got the dirty dingo in mode because without that, he'd be, he'd be fucking dead to me probably. <laughs> fucking Fash. Start streaming again, you motherfucker, Fash. If, you, if you're listening, if you're watching the VOD or something, if you get a break from cutting trees for Lupac, fucking start streaming again, you piece of shit. I would literally watch him fucking chopping down trees and the motherfucker won't even, won't even fucking stream it. That's bad news, that, isn't it? Like, to be fair, I'm not streaming me being AFK on <laughs> on GTA, which basically essentially equates to what Fash is doing. But I only have like, you know, I'm I've got the I've got the <laughs> I've got the control as elastic band elastic banded together for that. So it's you know, I, I can do that completely AFK, the GTA stuff. So um so it's not really comparable to him actually having to click on the trees. So he should stream it. If he's there, if he's there in front of his computer actively clicking on the trees, he should be streaming it. Oh god, the stick bases was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking... That Conan game. <laughs> Everyone played it for like a month, didn't they? All, all you could see on Twitch was fucking dick swinging about on fucking Conan. And then everyone just stopped at the same time. <laughs> Thanks, Tony. <laughs> I should play a show with you, Dad Simulator. Should play it on stream. I haven't played it yet. I, I saw the, the video for it, and you've basically got like a dark haired man, white man, a ginger white man, and a black man, and then you get you get the corresponding type of kid, and you've got to run to it. But there's no it, there's no funny business. It's just like you know, just seemed pointless to me to play it. Yeah, XCOM 2. Oh man. I should play XCOM 2. All I did was create the men and never play a game. Well. <laughs> he did the ball down on no balls. Which, I don't know, can I put pressure on? Not really. No, it's not that I want to cheat by using a strategy I found on the internet. I just want to fucking know what, like, what you have to fucking do. I don't even understand what this fucking thing ticking down is and all this kind of crap. It just pisses me off. It just actually pisses me off at the moment. Um, XCOM. Right, so giving up a block there, but it, I don't think I don't hit. It. Especially don't hate it if this guy gets in. Right. Mm. 
yeah, it just... <laughs> That's true, BZL. I should have, yeah, maybe, maybe I could and should have done. Oh yeah, the, the fucking the gate, the, the doing the missions is the easiest thing in the world. Yeah, and XCOM is, uh, is just literally the easiest thing. The battles are no problem at all. <laughs> but it's the yeah it's the what to um it's what to what to research and what is this fucking this terror track whatever the fuck it is I'm like i don't even know what the fuck it is to be fair i did saw patreon um at least a bit yeah these lo these are not up to the usual standard of lowness skins Yeah, the, the actual battles are no problem at all. The problem is this fucking Doom Track. Whatever, what the fuck is it? Doom Tracker or Terror Tracker? Whatever. What the fuck it is? I just didn't understand. I didn't know what to do. Like, like, like XCOM 1, where if you didn't know you had to build satellites, you were just fucked, weren't you? Like, that was, that was such a bad, such a fucking bad mechanic in XCOM 1 with the the fucking satellites, holy shit. Really dumb. And, um... Right, need to start a Crusaders run here. That was dumb. Just like every turn you've had, buddy. No change there. Nah, that's a bit harsh. Bit harsh. No need to be nasty. Um, but... His double GFI and then re-rolling the block was terrible. And, uh, you know, when you know you've only got one or two re-rolls, that was uh, questionable at best. This isn't an easy turn, I don't think, because there's, um, there's stuff that could happen, isn't there? It's hard for me to actually... Do anything now without the skinks. His blitzer skink has paid off. Both down. I mean, if I had both down that, it would have been the beast of Nurgle that was Kaz, not the uh, not the skink. But, uh, Blood bowels, Mister Nice strikes again. My opponent is a big dummy. Cheers, mate. <laughs> 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 oh, brilliant. Thank you, Tony. Um, yeah. He's down his strength four guy, but yeah, down three skings and down the Saurus. It's not good, is it? My <laughs> opponent's a big dummy. Yeah. I didn't really say that, did I? It was just, it was just heavily implied. Dead Marauder is injured. The funniest thing is, but him dodging away actually was really bad because that freed up that guy. Like it was actually worse for him to succeed the dodge anyway than it was to just keep keep a Saurus held up. I was aware of the time I was just tapped out playing Crusades of the Lost Idols. <laughs> uh, <laughs> funnily enough, given the name of the team, I was actually, and all the players, that's what I was doing. Ooh, two legendary cat catalysts. That's not bad, is it? Catalyst. I 
now we just run down that side. I thought he just rotated back to the middle, especially when the crocs went done. So I don't know how he's going to stop the Saurus getting him now. Guess we'll find out. Yeah, Dominic. Goofy and then dodge that guy out. Yeah, that kind of works. Still just a double GFI to hit him though, isn't it? Didn't come down. This guy, one, two, three, four, five, six, double GFI. Even if he does dodge him out and run him all the way around. <laughs> yeah, he's expecting the gym pals. <laughs> right, so he elected to not even try to stop me um, hitting the ball. Interesting strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. Ah, but he's the recovery guy. So maybe I do do the double GFI. And then at least I've got the recovery. I'll try and make this block first, just see what happens. I think I think I'd probably do because there's no there's literally no recovery unless I go this way, is there? <laughs> Didn't get the gym powers. Oh, I did got an actual power then. Holy shit! Take the ball down. Oh no, he didn't. Wow. <laughs> what down the colours? Um, well, not really. I'm mostly enjoying. <laughs> mostly, I'm enjoying Saurus getting cast. Um, all right, season four. Okay, I'll, I'll look into it, Elmato. I'll look into it. Delsa humans. Yeah, absolutely. Tony's right. Just try for the pet. Oh, Chorf's banned, are they? Oh, yeah, dead's not bad, is it? Yeah, own dead's a good shot. Undead, Dark Elves, humans. All pretty good. Surprised he bothered knocking off the croc, seeing as it does fuck all. Chalk North Dawson zones. Yeah, that makes sense. They're all they are all too powerful. Now. Orcs are pretty good, aren't they? I wouldn't mind orcs.
he blocks him, he can block him, and then that's a source freed up, isn't it? He frees him up with the gym pals. I wouldn't mind lizards. The lizards don't really need any skills, do they? <laughs> yeah. I've got them. I realised I might I might change them because I can I can spam them, like you know wherever I go, can't I? So I I I would I've, what I might do is I might remake them. So like I might make I might make kind of really good trolling ones that I can I can troll with, um, because I'll be the only one who has them. It might be a funny thing to do. I thought I wouldn't mind like some kind of cross out, um, some kind of cross out emote. But I don't know what that could be really for that. Garbage truck. Combat prime. <laughs> mm. He can blitz to then get a block there and then potato. Need a power though, pretty much. Let him activate his piece. Right, if this is just full on potato now. Ah, shit. Fail the dog. Of course I did. Yeah, that was, that was the weakness of going for that. But I mean, if I'd made that dodge, I think I'm pretty much safe then. Because could have outrun him. Thousand HP one card. So nice. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Fucked out the man. <laughs> Fucking guard in the full side. They're still, they're still all fucking strength four, though, aren't they? And that. Eh. <sighs> oh shit, I forgot to build things. Cross up.
fucking thing at six with big black scorpions, which is no fun for me. So I'm gonna have to try and max scrap tomorrow. Hopefully it's something a format I can win at. Why is a 75? It's actually cheaper than yesterday, isn't it? They were late yesterday. Of course he's got the ball. Of course he's got the ball, motherfucker. Fucking extra arms, lad. Captain Spitfire, maybe he plays cross out. Can you get five in that? No, oh, if I'm eight times out of nine, I would have just fucking made that dodge and got away. Thunderbolts down at three six seven. Unbelievable. Toe down at two seven seven. Charge radiator four seven nine. Holy shit! Shouldn't have fucking built the wrong things. I built. Uh, Radar detectors because they were worth more. At the time. No. no. as a three plus. He can't fail the one in three after I fail the one in nine. Blah. Fucking extra arms. Extra arms, lad. That's what he's got, isn't it? It's, he doesn't have an extra arms player. He's got an extra arms, lad. That's what it is.
Hmm. No. Draw against 1100. No, but he didn't really play very well. Feels bad. A chance of a one turn, I guess. No, probably not with eight players. And no side step. I like how he carried on saying stuff just by getting zero response. I haven't had to think this hard in a while. Uh, See, that's nice, isn't it? It's nice when people say stuff like that instead of calling somebody fucking lucky as fuck. But he did well getting the cards on the skinks, didn't he? Well, well. <laughs> as, uh, as Bill Brasky would say. Um, I just didn't have the players at the end. Maybe I should have played that turn differently to not have to, uh, not have to make a dodge with dodge. Dodge with dodge shouldn't be, you know, that's kind of, I think that's acceptable. Yeah, way to go. Well rolled is my favourite. Right, blitz in, push into there, push into there. Possible, isn't it? Don't really care how much. Oh. I need him now, don't I? I'll just have to go over the other ship. So if these two run around there, he blocks, pushes into there. These two, one, two. Oh, well he can go there. He can go there, he can go there. Two guys come behind, he pushes him to there. Then he pushes him to there. And then it's... Um, Nice of him, isn't it? What a fucking nice guy. <laughs> what the fuck's. I don't know why the fuck he's playing Blood Ball if he's this fucking nice. Um. Is this three dice? I think it is. for the what's it called? Disturbing presence, isn't it? So he's away from there. So a three plus three plus and then um, some dodges and some GFIs. Didn't roll well. Oh, VIP backings. It was nearly there, and it got the pushes thanks to the quick snap. Don't know if I could have done it without the quick snap, to be fair. 
No MVP for Saurus. Twice as many armor breaks, so he probably just outplayed me to be fair there. I do feel a little hard done by that Y9 though. To be honest. But then fair play for him making me roll a one in nine. So yeah, so while while a minus armor Saurus is awful, it's probably probably be better than a journeyman skink, isn't it? So um So that's it's probably worth keeping him. That's why I didn't. I'm not going to sack him in future Saurus that get perms like that because an injured Saurus, either a niggled or a minus AV or a minus movement, whatever, they're still better than a journeyman skink, aren't they? So, oh, there you go. The record, the record going right down the shitter, but still, sixteen four four isn't isn't awful, is it? At the end of the day. Um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.